Hi, my name is Derek Sarte and I'm here to talk about accuracy and precision. Hi, my name is Giselle Geramos and I'm here to teach you about accuracy and precision. Hello, my name is Michael Elsterius and I am here to teach you about accuracy and precision. This is number one. It shows that this this diagram shows that it is accurate in precise. We, we can say that it, that it is accurate because the the dots are in the standard value and it is and the dots are close to one another, so it is precise and accurate. The diagram number two is it is not accurate but precise. We can say it it is not accurate because the dots are far away from the standard value and the dots are precise because the dots are close to one another. And the diagram number three, we can say that it is not precise nor accurate because the dots are far away from it, so it's other, so it's not precise. And also, it is not accurate because the dots are not in the standard value. And the fourth, on the fourth diagram, it shows that it is accurate but not precise. You can see it is not precise because the dots are not close to each other. It is accurate because the dots are so close to the standard value. Accuracy and precision can also apply in real life, just like this example. How many students in grade 11 does it? I need, a, I need an observation by asking some students if how many students in the 11 dozen? Some students say that there are 35 students in the 11 dozen, 40, 36, 41, 55, 45, 50, and 37. So the standard measure of a dinner table's length is 25 centimeters, and I measured it six times. The first measurement is 24.3 centimeters. The second measurement would be 24.9 centimeters, and third measurement is 24.91 centimeters. The next is my fourth measurement would be 25.6 centimeters. The fifth would be 25.81 cm and lastly my sixth would be 26.0 cm. Then after that I add all my measurements, then I divide it by six because I have six measurements and the result would be 24.9 cm. So therefore it is a precise and accurate. Thank you for watching and we are the D.